Hey there, today I'm gonna to tell you four steps to becoming a successful real estate agent. So you think you wanna sell real estate and you wanna get into it and make a lot of money and help a bunch of people. Well, there are four steps that I believe are most important to get you started in that process of becoming a successful real estate agent. Step one is two things. You need to get your license and join a team. This is super important. It's really important to get your license because that is how you're going to sell real estate. You have to be licensed in whatever state you live in or want to sell in. And so you have to go through the coursework. You can ask someone uh, who's already done it, how they did it, or you could ask a mentor how they got their real estate license, or you could interview the team that you wanna join and figure out how people on that team actually got their license. The second part of that is joining a team. I think it's really important to join a team because they're going to have all of the resources and the process behind them already established for you to learn to become a great real estate agent. It's really important to learn in this process and make sure that you are understanding exactly what you need to do. And a team is definitely going to help you do that. They're going to help you understand exactly what you need to do every single day and how to get new clients and really build your database up so that you have a lot of people who wanna buy and sell with you. Teams also sometimes provide customers to people on their team, which can be really important as a new agent because you may not know enough people right off the bat who wanna buy and sell with you. So the best and fastest way to start making income for yourself is really to join that team and be able to get leads from them and be able to learn and grow from them. It's super important. That's exactly how I started. I joined a team, was on that team, and learned a ton from the team before I actually went out on my own. The second step is that you need to build your sphere of influence. A sphere of influence is all of those people who you know. They're people that already know you, like you, and trust you, and would want to have you help them buy or sell real estate. These are those people like your mom, your dad, your brother, your cousin, anyone you know, your old coworkers, people who have already worked with you, they know you, they trust you, they would allow you to help them in their real estate journey. It's going to be a whole lot easier to find your first deal when you're working with people who already know you and like you and trust you because they're going to put their trust in you for such a huge transactional purchase. It's really important to network with these people and make sure that they know that you're now in real estate. You can send out cards, you can direct message all of them, you can start your social media, make sure they're following you, and that's a great way to get started and announce to the world, those people who already love you, that you are now a real estate broker. Step number three to becoming a successful real estate broker is to start networking. Networking is one of the most important things because this is how you're going to meet new clients and customers. And meeting new people is the best way to get into finding people who will actually want to buy and sell with you. You have to meet a bunch of new people and be able to let them know that you're in real estate now and that you can help them with all of their real estate needs. So it's important to be part of different affinity groups be a part of different networking events and really put yourself out there. Make sure that everyone you meet knows you're in real estate. Now, don't be obnoxious about it. It's important not to come off too obnoxious about that you're a new real estate agent, but it is important to let them know and let it naturally come up in the conversation so that they know that you're someone that might be able to help them in the future if they're thinking about buying or selling. Step number four to becoming a successful real estate agent is to follow up. Following up is the most important thing in real estate. So many agents say they're going to do something and then don't actually follow through with doing it. You cannot let this happen for any of your customers. Your customers are relying on you to drive the process of their real estate transaction forward. So it's super, super, super important that you actually follow up with them, make sure they have what they need, and that you're staying in touch with them. It is not your client's job to make sure that they check in with you. You have to be the one that actually follows up with them. So when you tell someone you're going to do something or follow up with information, you must do it. Make sure you structure your day so that you're in an office and you're actually thinking about these people every single day and following up with them. This is the most surefire way to get you in front of more people and get more people to trust you because when you follow up, they'll be able to tell all of their friends how great you were during the real estate transaction because you did what you said you were going to say. Following up is so, so important. I spent so many days the first time I got into real estate, following up with people, really feeling like I was bugging them until they actually came back around and were ready to buy or sell. It's one of the most essential parts of real estate and it's really something you must do as a real estate broker. It is your job after all. 
There you have it. Those are the four steps I would take to become a successful real estate agent and sell millions of dollars of real estate every single year. It's super important that you follow along on these steps to get your career started and in no time you'll see success. Hey, if you're looking to work in Seattle and you want to join a successful team that where you can learn and grow and really start your business, be sure to reach out to us. We're here to help and we are always recruiting new people to our team. So don't hesitate to call, text, or direct message us and we would love to set up a time to speak with you. Thanks for tuning in. Be sure if you like videos like this to hit that subscribe button and get notified when all of our newest videos come out. See you next time.